During an investigation into leaking state secrets, former Mainland Affairs Council Vice Chairman Zhang Xianyao was said to have revealed that President Ma planned to meet Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping in Jingmen. The date of the meeting was to occur on August 23rd of last year, which is the 56th anniversary of China's artillery bombardment of the island. The new Mainland Affairs Council Chairman Andrew Sha paid a visit to TSU legislator Lai Chengchan. After a brief meeting, Lai came up with a number of probing questions. Zhang Xianyao, mm -hmm. you, you also... Zhang Xianyao broke the news about the time and place of a Ma Shi meeting, with news that a gift had already been prepared. The event was to take place in Jinmen on August 23rd. Even the gift of a knife was to be presented. Is this correct? We believe that APEC is the most suitable occasion for the president's meeting with his cross-strait counterpart. It's unfortunate that China did not have the same opinion, and we did not make any other arrangements. Xia only admitted to the fact that Taiwan had hoped for a Ma Xi meeting at APEC. However, rumors have circulated regarding another location for a potential meeting during an investigation into Zhang Xianyao's alleged leaking of state secrets. The meeting was said to be held on the 56th anniversary of the August 23rd artillery bombardment of Jinmen, with the island's famous knives made from artillery scraps even selected as a gift. In the end, the complex nature of relations involving Taiwan, China, and the U.S. would ultimately doom such a meeting. Ma Xihui, I I see the media says that a Ma Xi meeting was the reason that I resigned. How come no one told me this? Speculation of a scrapped Ma Xi meeting in Jinmen is leading many to take a renewed interest into just why Zhang Xianyao was so quickly forced out of his post within the Mainland Affairs Council.